Today in front of me, I have this Sony Xperia 10 Mark IV smartphone. And in this video, we would like to share the best display settings to change on this device. So first of all, let's go ahead and open up the settings here. We'll head straight for the display category. And the first option that I would highly recommend it to try altering is called image quality settings. And in here, we can choose between two values that uh, provide to you with various, I mean, different color gamut and contrast. And the standard mode value also has this video image optimization toggle as well. The next option that we would like to show you in this video is located right below the last one and called white balance. As you could guess, it allows you to, well, configure and adjust the white balance uh, and as well as uh, separately adjust the red, green and blue color palettes, as you can see. So we have warm, medium, cool, and custom presets. And in custom, you're able to regulate each color of the RGB palette individually, just like so. I'll leave it at cool, for example. The next option is called lock screen preferences, located a little bit down the road. So let's go ahead and open it. Here it allows you to make all kinds of personalizations with how uh, your lock screen looks in general and how the elements uh, it has work or look as well. So here we are able to choose how does the clock will look. So I'll go with this design, for example. There is also the toggle that is responsible for waking up the display on a key press. It is also possible to, well, uh, tap in some random custom lock screen message. So let me do just that. decide whether all notifications will be shown or no notifications whatsoever. And keep notification toggle is also present over here, as you can see. So we'll, uh, well, made some slight changes to the lock screen. So let's go ahead and see what does it look like. As you can see, everything that we have changed has actually taken effect. So the clock is the one we've uh, uh, gone for, the custom sign is right here at the bottom part of our display and notification content is shown as well already and let's go ahead and move on to the last option that we were to show you in this video so for it you gotta scroll almost all the way down and it's called the night light so once enabled as you can see it makes all the colors significantly warmer and the interface color palette in general which makes it so using the display of your device gets significantly easier. So here we have the bar that allows us to regulate the warmness intensity. So we can go from cool colors all the way up to warm or set up some custom schedule for it to be automatically turned on and turned off just like so. Alrighty, so that was it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and bye-bye.